Hey kittens, Silver here with my Hill House West Lewis and Clark Newfoundland puppy and I have a very very exciting package that arrived in today's mail. I am so unbelievably stoked for this particular plush. Um, it's funny, this little dog here was kind of like a, a substitute plush that I was going, uh, that, that I had bought just because I did not think that I was going to find this particular plush anytime soon. Um, and fate proved me wrong when one of my closest friends on Instagram alerted me that uh, a seller on eBay had listed this plush. Um, completely unbeknownst to me, it somehow uh, sort of escaped my usual search terms. And, uh, and there he was. I responded immediately, made an offer, and landed the, the little puppy. So I was beyond thrilled, and I cannot wait to see him in person now. So this is going to be the uh, Douglas Cuddle Toys uh, Newfoundland puppy. This is going to be St. John, who was retired uh, many years ago. I'm not even sure what year he was uh, officially retired, but... Um, and I'm also really excited to see how the two of these puppies will look side by side and how they compare with one another because uh, this little guy actually did seem remarkably similar, uh, more so than I was expecting, particularly after I did his little uh, mouth surgery on him. So I'm going to pause this video now and get this box open and let's see what St. John looks like. Okay, we have the box open now. And this little fella is just looking in curiously to see uh, see what his new little friend is up to. So let's take this out. Okay, this is actually a seller I've purchased from in the past before too. Um, I also bought my uh, my Sadie King Cavalier uh, Spaniel from her, and I see actually right. In the back of the box is another note. I remember this from the last time around too. Oh, she's this this seller is so so sweet. She always sends a thank you note with her plushies. So let me just see if I can. Ooh, let me pause for a second while I get this out. Okay, so here is her little thank you card. The little silvery cursive script, very fancy. And she writes, thank you again for your purchase. Hope you enjoy this precious baby. He's a beauty. Warmest regards, Nancy. Oh, thank you so much. I'm kind of shaking a little bit because I'm I'm that excited for this plush. Um, wow, all right. <laughs> I gotta compose myself. Um, let me put this down. And let's get this unwrapped. Luckily, it's very easy. It's sort of like a tissue paper, so I can just Go like that. Oh. Oh. oh my goodness. The silky fur. Oh my gosh. I'd be content just to just to feel him and <laughs> not even see him. He's, he already feels so, so nice. I see the little white locket of fur here too on his chest. Okay, oh my gosh, I cannot believe I'm holding this guy in my hands right now. Here we go. Okay, let's get this tissue paper out. He's got his back to the camera. Okay, let's take a look at St. John. Ooh, the baby! Oh my god! Look at that face! Sweetie pie, oh my gosh, instantly in love. Oh, he's so sweet. Oh, he's got that same long haired um, sort of mane that uh, that this guy has. I still haven't come up with the proper name, maybe Lewis or Clark for this guy. Um, so yeah, very similar um, fur styles. But oh my gosh, his face is absolute perfection. It's just the sweetest little puppy dog face. Oh, look how just just adorable and just earnest that expression is. He's absolutely perfect. And he feels just like new still. He wasn't marked as new, but you would not have really even known that this plush was pre-owned. 
Um, he didn't have a hang tag, but that's <laughs> that is no no concern of mine whatsoever. Um, he he does still have his tush tags intact if my camera focuses, which it probably won't. But um, I don't think there's anything particularly informative on these tags. I was kind of curious to see if there was a date because I can't remember how long it's been since he's been made. But oh wow! And look at it has sort of like a luster to it. The hair when you see the sunlight hit it. Like it sort of has almost like a like a midnight sheen to it, if that makes sense. And he's got that really, really nice leather nose. Uh, and he's got the dark eyes, which uh, I believe are rimmed in uh, brown or amber. Uh, let me see. It, it looks completely black right now on uh, on camera and even in person. But yeah, I think there is, they are sort of lined with that with that brown color that uh, that Douglas dogs typically are. It's just, it's just really hard to see on camera. Oh my gosh, though. And he's so squishy. And here, let's, yup, nice and floppy as well. The face is just absolute, just wonder, wonderfully perfect. Um, oh, and I love the little white tuft as well. Gives him a little bit of extra pizzazz. Just like this guy, actually, but he's got his little collar on, too. Oh, look how cute they look together. They're the perfect pair. Yeah, look at, they, they really do have a, a lot of similarities. Um, this guy, his nose is a little bit larger than St. John's, and uh, you can see more of the brown around his eye. It's quite, sort, of, sort of more of a rounder eye, it seems like, or it has that appearance anyway. Um, sort of larger and, yeah, a little bit more pronounced. Um, oh my goodness though, this guy though, look at, it's just the pure innocence, uh, the absolute purity of the expression is just beyond words. I absolutely adore him and oh my gosh, I, I cannot say enough about him. Um, so if anybody ever has the opportunity to, uh, to buy St. John, if they come across one on an, on an eBay listing, um, do not hesitate. He is absolutely precious. Um, I know Douglas also right now has a another Newfoundland plush uh, about the same size as St. John called Bundy, um, but his material is a little bit different, um, not quite as soft and, uh, you know, pleasantly textured, I guess. I haven't seen him in person or felt him, so uh, I can't say. I'm just sort of going by um, what I've read online and what I can kind of deduce from seeing him. Um, but I was sort of curious to see what Bundy is like in person too, but I think two, two Newfoundlands is probably enough. Um, oh my gosh. So anyway, that was St. John and huge, huge thank out, uh, shout out. I can't even speak properly. Shout out to my friend. She goes, um, by the name Time Wolf on Instagram. So, uh, I will try to remember to leave a link to her, inst her Instagram account. In the description so you can take a look and see some of the plush that she's collected she has an amazing assortment of different douglas and she's just one of the sweetest kindest just most amazing individuals that i've met on that ent entire platform so oh thank you so much i am going to just love this little guy to pieces i already do um so yeah, thank you guys for joining me on my my little uh, plush journey today, and we'll be taking our, our very next plush adventure very soon, I'm sure. Bye, everybody.